today's video, we'll show you how to create this torn paper effect in Video Vlogger. And you can use it in your own vlogs and make the video more vivid. So if you're interested in this one, keep watching the video. First, open VidiPro Vlogger. Import a prepared background clip. For example, here I used a clip of the wood. Then, import it into video track. Click this button in the transform to make your video screen. Next, import a clip again. It can be either a picture or video. This time, we import it into the overlay track. Again, make the clip fit your screen. Next, let's create an intro animation for the clip. Click on Motion to enter the motion editor. Add a keyframe on the leftmost side. Adjust the box so that it has the same size as the screen. Then, do what you see here in the video. Rotate the box and move it out of the window. At this point, the preview window on the right will turn completely black. Next, place a second keyframe at the first second. Then, move the box back to its original position. At last, add a keyframe to the rightmost part of the timeline. You can click play to preview it. At this point, the material has a flying effect. And we can also select a second keyframe and select the Smooth Speed Down 1 in Speed to create a smooth animation. Click Apply to return to the main interface. Next, we work on the black and white part. Click Color to enter the Color Editing panel. Then, let's adjust the saturation of the image to the minimal. Slightly increase the value of the contrast. Then, click Apply to return to the main interface. Next, let's create a torn paper effect. First, we import this torn effect green screen clip. You can download it through the link we put in the description box down below. Then we create a new overlay track. Import this clip into it. Here, what we need to do is to place it after the image is fully entered. Then, use Ripple Edit to crop all three pieces of materials to the same length. Next, remove the playhead. When the preview window turns green, click on the clip. Find the chroma key in the Spectre. Check the Enable box to remove the green screen. At this point, we can export the video. Select a high-quality engine when exporting. Then import the exported clip into the project again. Delete all the clips from the timeline. Then put the original footage into the video track. Put the re-import clip into the overlay track. Resize it. Drag the playhead until the blue screen appears in the preview box. Then, find a chroma key in Inspector. Click on a small window to absorb the blue color from the screen using the straw in Color Picker. Then, check Enable. You might need to adjust the tolerance and smoothness values so that the torn paper effect remains. apply this method in transition like this. Well, this is all for today's video. And if you want to know more about other end tricks or what has been going on with VidiPro Vlogger, be sure to click that subscribe button to subscribe channel if you haven't yet. And we'll see you soon in our next video. Hope you enjoy. Bye-bye.